Fully autonomous transportation will be a part of our daily lives in the future. Today, human intervention is still needed in the teleoperation of autonomous vehicles. Current teleoperations on 4G do not receive sufficient communication bandwidth for real-time sensor and video data transmission, causing substantial latency in teleoperation and haptic feedback. Without real-time haptic feedback, teleoperators using these systems are prone to motion sickness. As part of the 5G at Sentosa program, the National Environment Agency and Nanyang Technological University are trialing high-fidelity teleoperated autonomous vehicles connected on Singtel 5G. The developed system provides 180-degree frontal image surrounding the driver and the first in the world to simulate vehicle movements, acceleration and steering wheel stiffness in real time as haptic feedback to the teleoperator. We can use this uh, teleoperation to control a driverless vehicle such as a sweeper in a remote location. And here the teleoperator is in NTU and the sweeper is in Sentosa. So in this uh, teleoperation, there is a requirement of uh, transmitting large amount of data from Sentosa to NTU. With 5G, videos with maximum achievable image quality Haptic feedback information and control signals can be transmitted back to NTU in real time, allowing the teleoperator to respond immediately. So we partner with uh, GovTech and Singtel to carry out this trial at uh, 5G at Sentosa. And so far the result has been very successful. The running has been very smoothly. And we believe this uh, uh, 5G can be used in our future application of teleoperating of any kind of uh, autonomous vehicle, heavy vehicles. Singtel 5G's powerful capabilities create huge potential for teleoperations to be applied across multiple platforms and machinery beyond AVs. Combined with multi-axis edge computing, 5G will drive the evolution of connected and autonomous vehicles. Explore how 5G and MEC can help transform your industry.